that is a great aerial view of where the action is taking place at the Yonex Thailand Open, the Impact Arena in northern Bangkok, the scene of three top badminton tournaments at the start of 2021. And it's the Yonex Thailand Open that kicks things off in January. And here we are on day three on court two. Plenty of action so far, plenty of action still to come. We've just seen uh, local favourite Busanan Ong Bang Rumpan beat Sana Newal in a marathon battle there, 2-1. 21-23, 21-14, 21-16. And now in the men's doubles, we have Matthias Christiansen and Nicholas Noor of Denmark up against Malaysia's Gertzofe and Noor Izudin. And it could well be an all Malaysian affair with uh, Go and Tan already making it through, beating Lane and Vendi quite easily. On court two, men's double, Matthias Christiansen and Niklas Noor from Denmark versus. Ko Chu Fei and Noor Ituzdin from Malaysia. Umpire. So here are the Danes coming through. Service Matthias Christensen. Ramida Asawaposo from Thailand. Who has got a gold in the Thomas Cup in the men's team. Silver in the European Championships in 2018. And uh, a couple of golds as well in 2016 and 2018 in the European Men's Team Championships. His partner, Nicholas, Nicholas Noor, a gold in the European Games in 2015, silver in the European Championships in 2016 as well. And what about their Malaysian opponents right here? Noor Izzuddin has got a silver in 2020, the Asia Team Championships, as well as a bronze in 2018. Silver in the Men's doubles in the Sea Games of 2017. First meeting okay, between we'll the toss. these pairs. Black or red? They take black. You have red. It's red. Niklas to serve. No to receive. On which side? Here. Good luck. Go to Faye. There's a silver and bronze in the Asian Team Championships and a silver with the Southeast Asia Games. He's been a uh, partner with Norrisden for quite some time now. Matthias Christensen, 26, 188 from Bornholm in Denmark. Highest ranking of 19th with David Dalgaard. And that was uh, achieved. In September of 2017, Nicholas Snor, 29-185 from Nystved, 32nd with uh, Kasper Antonsen. That was back in uh, his 22nd, back in 2016, he achieved that. Christensen and Noor beat Adam and Mayo, 21-16, 16-21, 21-15. An experienced pair. More on that exploits in just a while. Nor is it in. 23. 28th in the world. 23rd is his best ranking. We go to a phase from Southern Malaysia and Johor. They achieved that, by the way, in November of 2019, their highest ranking, these two. And also 23 is go to a from further up the country in Negri Sembilan. Nicholas Law was also involved in the mixed doubles. Lost that to Pravin Jordan and Malati Daiva Octavianti. He was uh, getting a little feisty at times. 
with some of the decisions being made, especially on serves. And uh, the umpire was bearing the brunt of that. Umpire Make today is Ivo Cassel from Switzerland. And Ramida is the service judge. And Christensen was also involved in the mixed doubles earlier today. Beat uh, Marcus Ellis and Lauren Smith. 21-18-21-18. So I wonder if they have any lasting effects on him. Power players, both of them. Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Noor Izzuddin and Scotia Fay, Malaysia. And on my left, Matthias Christiansen and Niklas Noor, Denmark. Niklas Noor to serve to Noor Izzuddin. Love all. Play. One. Good start. Wow. Good, easy start there for Noor and Christiansen. Is it into the net? And, uh, love. Well, they had a very good start to this tournament, didn't they? Oh. Defeating the uh, Korean pair of oh. Ko Seung Hyun and Shin Baek Chul in three games 21 16, 19 21, 21 11. Great result, that one. Team up for it. Two. They're oh. lively, aren't they? Go on, is it in? They're going to be all over this court, you can imagine. And work these much bigger players. Yeah, going for everything. Trying to play kills, jump Three, smashes. Two. fast pace about this already entertaining vigorous isn't it three four setting the tone I think for this match I wonder whether they'll exploit the fact that Christensen's already played earlier today Couple of chances to kill that off earlier, didn't they? Izudin and Go. Out. 
Time is over. Five, four. Just trying to force the issue there. Five, all. Christiansen. Yeah, saw that pocket of space in the far corner. Just trying to push towards it. A buzz of energy Five. about the Malaysians at the moment. How they're going about things. Uh, disappointing. Six, seven. From uh, go after they just built that little two point lead to give up on the serve. Hey. Good reactions initially, and at the fourth seven, time of asking, oh. Christiansen puts it away. Points being exchanged freely at the moment between the two. Eight, they come at such a terrific seven. height, the Danes. Let's see if they can overturn. We've seen a, a series of overturns so far, successful appeals and challenges. And it is quite clearly challenge in. Unsuccessful. One challenge remaining. Service over. Eight, all play. Well, that's what they're trying to do earlier. Nine, eight, and this time it. Goes to its intended target to that far corner. Oh. 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 Serve is over. Yeah, lots Nine. of great oh. jump smashes there, a series of them. Some good defensive work. But Isidin's power finally seeing him through. Not much in this one.
about to attack that serve immediately. We'll pay the price. This time it worked is over. for Christiansen. Ten all. That was played very well right into that bottom corner and difficult to return from Noor. And the Malaysians go in with that one point lead here, 11 10. there wasn't it for Uzudin yes. it's a pretty decent one as well to kill that off not taken rose up well got above the shuttle oh wasn't it looked odds on to make that one Good rally, that one, that again, just full of vigour. Power shots everywhere. Entertaining to watch. Just getting things wiped down. There's a lot of going into this at the moment from both of them. They're putting everything into it. Great to see. Well, oh. Very, very tight at the moment. Well, they'll take that. They'll be happy. Go on, Isudin. 
Slender lead. Yeah, just try to go on the drop. Well, this is where they'll be very dangerous. That was Nor 13, smashing, 14. as we said, with the height that they've got, becomes very difficult to return. And the speed of the pitch it comes at them. Played there by Christiansen again. Sheer power and pace getting the better of go. And they're giving them a taste of their own medicine. Is it in there? He's being the one executing more of those jump smashes. From the backcourt. This is really, really tight, isn't it? This time, playing the more gentle shot works out. The drop. 15, all. There you go, it's 17, 15. nothing more than a couple of points between. Well, Gorn Isidin have edged ahead at an important part of this game now. Can they see it through? Attacking the net, we haven't seen much in terms of net play. Now, I think that's the first time we've had three-point lead 50. in this. Put away with a plum. And they're on a roll here, is it? This is their bus best yes. sequence of points okay. in the match so far. Everything okay? I haven't I have enough in the tank to see this out now.
Service over. Well, they had to really make a move, didn't they? Otherwise, Go and Isidin will be within striking distance of taking this first game. Seventeen, nineteen. Oh! That is over. Right. Twenty. Didn't last long, and points. they've got three game 17. points here. The Malaysians. It's a uh, tough time to be making an unforced error like that. And Christiansen. That is over. 18 20. Nineteen. Well, they're whittling down that lead. In keeping with the pattern we've had this afternoon. Some tight matches here. Well, they've done it. They've edged out first the Danes game, there. Go and Isudin in the first game. 21-19, but it was a fast-paced. Very much an entertaining first game. Lots of big shots being played. They've done well. On court three, women's double. Chloe Burge and Lauren Smith from England. Versus Mike and Forever and Sarah Digicet from Denmark. I'm part. Emmanuel Kabuizele from Botswana. Service Judge. Wahyana from Indonesia. Yeah, <laughs> Så må I hellere slå ja, eller slå en eller anden vild kryds bare. Ja, Fyre til en kryds, og så se om den går. Ja. Øh, det der halvbløde ind i midten, det går simpelthen ikke. Det er for langsomt. Ja. Øh, lidt klar på, at han gode, vil gerne gå op og lægge den kort lige nu på returene på os. Ja, meget mere trykker. Vores server må gerne gå frem på den, og så har øh, vores barmand den anden. Fordi der, der kommer en til os hver, den kommer ikke sådan lige ned mellem os. Og så har den anden, han ligger og trykker lige nu. Jeg tror, at der er to fire på den ene kant, og så vil det være, være klar bagmand. Call 2, 20 seconds. Call 2, 20 seconds. So lots of chats going on there between coaches and players and how to overcome their opponent. It's a very tight affair between these two pairs. Last in action in the... One last. Salah Luck's open. Christiansen, he lost in the round of 32. Oh. Two last. And the men's doubles with uh, his current partner here. But he won the final in the mixed doubles. With Ma against Mark Lumsfuss and Isabel Hetrick, we, we saw an action here as well. Hey! 
is over. So they've certainly One, seen uh, two. some action quite recently. And uh, as with many of the Asian players, back at when they were last in action it was again at the All England where Laura Zidin and Goto Fe were defeated by Aaron Chia and So We Yik from uh, their, own, their own countrymen 15-21, 17-21 that was almost uh, 10 months ago so it was difficult hit that one, misjudged it. Christiansen. Yeah, he was playing the deceptive one, wasn't he? Trying to disguise it. Didn't quite hit it the way he wanted to. Beautifully dispatched. Four. Is it in? Is it going to miss from there? Ah. Uh, the perfect height for him. has been in superb form with those jump smashes. Five, three. And he's been really coming down hard on it. Look at that. Absolutely no chance. Right between the two players. Also, he's landing it early. 382. There you go. Terrific speed on it. Oh, and that is, that is over. we've seen that Four, quite a bit from Norn five. Christensen where they've mixed it up quite nicely with the drops. Probably varying it a little bit more than Gowen Isudin. Once again, very little between these two competitors. Go gets into the action now with a kill shot there. see here is is what we saw pretty much in the first game where no one could get ahead of steam or, or real momentum until right at the very end of the first game when Gordon Isidin went on to win it but it was tight <laughs> started by Isidin finished off by Go 
and they are changing shuttles pretty much at the end of each rally Seven, at the moment. Five. It's taking that much okay, abuse. It is not easy. Ping on the receiving end of that. Eight, five. And so a three-point lead here is certainly different to what we've seen so far. Well, that is a terrific, terrific dive there from Isidin to get that back. They didn't win the point, but what a lovely save there. Worth seeing again. Here we go. That, to me, is one of the shots of the, of the day. Didn't get a point off it, but just lovely to watch. Helps that he also has some... Leggings on. And even if you lose the point, but you get you get that return over, it just lifts you, doesn't it? Here's Chris Janssen, challenges called out. So we do have a challenge here. The Danes felt that was in. Unsuccessful. Well, it was out. One challenge remaining. So it's over. Nine. They maintain six. that three point lead. Play. So it's over. Well, that was one that should have been probably put away by Isudin. He knows it. Seven. Nine. Yeah, just a bit of hesitation there. They've Eight, gone for that far nine. corner and worked out well. The Danes. Oh. Oh, over. Yeah, frustration. You can just sense that. Ten. Eight. From the Danes again. Yes, the unforced errors, of course, that really will irritate, of course. He knows it. Two in a row that Eight. they've done. And it gives Goan Isidin a three-point lead going into the interval. 11-8. Ahead of Christiansen and Noor. Well, 
again, uh, just in two minds on how to play that and who was to play it. Four points now. Going as it is. And this is the biggest lead anyone has had in this match so far. Five points for the Malaysians. Five points clear. They yeah, misjudged that completely, Chris Jensen. Thirteen. Eight. Well, there's some comments about the serve. Couldn't quite hear. Thought I heard something about height. Oh! Three. Fourteen. Eight. Three, I think. Three. And four stairs in a row now. Four, perhaps. Just one before the interval. It's a very, very good run here. Four points on the trot for the Malaysians. Looking at the moment like they're cruising. And then that happens. Nine fifty. Wasn't it? The respite. And they are now eight points clear, looking good. Eighteen, nine. Can they stop this now? Otherwise, it's all over for the Danes. The unforced errors littered since the interval. Over 10-18. Got to do more now. It's found its way right to the very back of the court. 19. Go, is it in a race through this? They've been very good since the interval. The reactions from Go and Izzardin, absolutely brilliant. Right at the start of that rally. Save themselves. Again, they have been very good at their reactions. Looks to be a certain winner earlier. Once again, Izzardin throwing himself around. He has been Great value, superb entertainment from both Go and Izudin. Match points, they put one away immediately. Izzardin just slowing things down at the end. But great work from the Malaysian pair. And 
What looked to be a very tight affair in the first game certainly becomes much easier for the Malaysians in the second. And they played particularly well after the break, after the interval. And it was finished off there, the kill. Net kill by Go. And Go to Faye and Noor Isudin of Malaysia defeat Matthias Christiansen and Nicholas Noor of Denmark 21-19, 21-10.